Hey guys, so I just wanted to take a quick video of the um, result of the experiment with the fruit fly traps. Um, one thing to um, keep in mind here is that um, uh, when you're trying to get rid of the fruit fly, one of the things you've got to do is decrease the amount of available food for them anywhere else other than the traps, which is what I've had trouble doing is I've got so many um, pumpkins stored um, not far away and, um, and I've got so much food available in the shed here. Um, you could say uh, it wasn't a very fair test. Um, the, uh, to my mind, the, the, this trap here um, with the dry chicken pellets in it is actually the one that's worked um, the best. Um, the unfortunate part of the dry chicken, well, they're not dry, they're sort of moistened chicken feed pellets, um, is that the, um, uh, it doesn't kill them in the other ones that they, they end up drowning in the, in the liquid eventually. Um, whereas in that one there, um, they just sort of get more and more and more in there. Um, the uh, this this one here, I have to rip the bag open because I can't get it open two-handed. This one here is the um, uh, the liquid liquid in chicken pellets. Um, you can see it has got some some amount of um, fruit flies in there, but but not as many as the others. Um, white wine, basically useless. There's you know half a dozen or ten of them in there. The staminate and water worked out pretty well. There's there's quite a few in there. Um, rice wine vinegar, um, quite a few in there. That that looks good. Um, the molasses and water you can't see um, see them in the bottom because it's sort of gone all cloudy in the bottom. Um, and uh, with my naked eye, I can see in that stuff. Let's see if I turn it around so you guys can see um, but there is quite a few in the molasses and water and you can see them all still in the top there um, that's been very attractive to them it's a little bit smelly as well which may be the, the cause of um, why it's such a good attractant um, so uh, basically um, I mean I'd try the um, uh, apple cider vinegar that, that people say is quite good I just didn't have any of that to, to, to um, do it um, but again, you can see the basis of, of how these traps work, that the um, critters can get in down the neck of the bottle, and then when they try and fly out, they come up around the edge of the bottle, and then they can't get out. And eventually they buzz down into the water and get their wings coated with the um, dish soap uh, dish soap water, sort of, or not water, but the dish soap um, liquid that's in the bottom, and, uh, and drown. Anyway, so that's the uh, result of the fruit fly. Thank you.